Hi everyone, this is Valentine. Welcome back to my channel. And today I would like to review my new purchase from Cartier. So I am reviewing today the love bracelet, the very classic version of the love bracelet that my husband gifted me. Yes, I'm so excited. So this is not my first Cartier. I'm already having the um, nail bracelet and I'm having the ring, like our wedding bands of me and my husband. They are Cartier as well. And it was our anniversary and it is like a push gift and anniversary gift. So he just gifted me this bracelet and I'm so excited about it. And this is gonna be my first Cartier review here on my channel. Obviously I have more pieces from Cartier. I just never felt like I wanna review it here on my channel. So here it comes. So first of all, by the way, guys, you need an appointment to go to Cartier. So we went to the Cartier shop in Washington, DC. I wanted to buy from an official Cartier boutique, not from a reseller, but from an official Cartier boutique only because this is how I like to you know, shop because you have all the collections, you have all the pieces, you have the watch and so very on. So you can try it all on to be able to understand understand what you like more, what you like less, you know, also for future, what you would like to purchase in future, you know, try on more pieces just to think about it back home. If you want to like, you know, add more to your collection, like, I don't know, earrings or more bracelets and so very on. We actually came, we pretty knew that we we're going to get this bracelet. I was choosing between the small model and between the same model as the love bracelet, but the cuff one. So actually the cuff one is, looks a little bit different. The advantage of the cuff love bracelet it's the fact that you don't need someone to put it on you. It comes without the screwdriver. You just simply putting it on your hand, on your wrist, and that's all. It's like easy to wear it and easy to take it off. So you don't have to actually wear it 24 seven once it's on. The cuff bracelet costs about $2,000 less than the classic version because it is coming without the screwdriver so there is like less gold was wasted on this bracelet i got a feeling like it's a little bit wider even though it's supposed to be like exactly the same wide but i've got a feeling like it's a little bit like wider than the classic model and it is just looks kind of bad on the hand, honestly, like the cuff bracelet. You can see on the video that it's just, it like kind of goes out of your hand. Once the classic cuff bracelet is just like kind of hugging your hand in a perfect way, the cuff bracelet is like kind of goes out because it has to, it's like a cuff. Otherwise you cannot, you know, like put it on. So it is like goes out at the sides. And I just honestly thought it looks ugly. My husband said the same. He said it looks ugly on his opinion as well. And so this is why we just kept with the classic version with a screwdriver of this gorgeous Cartier bracelet. What I can say about this one, it's definitely a gorgeous piece of jewelry. Now guys, let me tell you the story of this bracelet and show you a few shots of me unboxing it and putting it on and taking it off. So guys, here it is, the unboxing of the timeless, the trending, and in my opinion, the best concept bracelet that I've ever seen. So the love bracelet was designed for Cartier by Aldo Cipulla. He is the designer behind the iconic Cartier's love collection and the Juste Anclou bracelets as well. This Cartier love bracelet was designed in New York City in 1969 and it is heralded a new age of modernity in the way we were jewelry. This bracelet is definitely unisex. It comes in three different colors, 18 carats of gold. It comes in white gold, in yellow gold, and in pink gold. I've got mine in pink gold because my opinion, this is the most gorgeous one, but I might get it in white gold as well. This bracelet was designed not for a special occasions wearing, but for every single day wear. So it is a securing to the wrist with its own precious screwdriver and it is capturing the spirit of the time when sexual liberation and casual luxury were coming to the force. I also own the nail bracelet from the Just Unclo collection that was designed and created at the 1972. By the way, we also have and own the rings, actually our wedding bands rings are from the same love collections and here I'm showing you my husband's ring and my ring as well. The Cartier love bracelet was controversially modeled after the medieval chastity belts. Yes, it is chasing and representing exactly the same idea. And this bracelet represents the ultimate symbol of a committed relationship. The bangle comprises of two pieces bolted together by using the tiny Cartier screwdriver. The idea is that it requires a partner to put it on 
for you by making it a lasting sign of your commitment to each other. So the idea of the bracelet is that you wouldn't be able to take it off once it's closed on your wrist as well as you cannot put it on by yourself only. You need a partner, a partner in love that will take it off from your wrist or will put it on your wrist. That's the idea. But at the same time, I have to say that it is definitely very possible and very easy to close it by yourself on yourself with a screwdriver that it is coming with as well as you can take it off or put it on. You can close it on yourself and you can open it on your wrist by yourself. So I definitely love the concept. I love the idea, but it is still possible to take it off and put it on by yourself only. So me and my husband, we really love the idea of this bracelet, you know, like a modern handcuff for the one that you love. Obviously half of the planet wearing these bracelets, so we aren't so unique. I'm wearing this bracelet for a week already and it's already got lots of scratches. So yes, this bracelet, it is scratched very easily. But the seller at the boutique told us like this bracelet was meant to wear and it doesn't matter how careful you'll try to be with this bracelet anyway, it is gonna get scratched. It was made to wear so you can take a shower, you can swim with this one, you can do anything you want with this bracelet. It is gonna get scratched anyway so he was like kind of just give up and let it get scratched because it's gonna get scratched anyway so my husband put this bracelet on me in the Cartier boutique and I just didn't take it off so far and it's already yes full of scratch and it is hurting my feeling so much like my heart just like bumps like crazy every scratch that I see but that's the destiny of every piece of gold jewelry it is just gonna get scratched and there is nothing you can do about it at all. This bracelet was just meant to wear, so you're supposed to just put it on and just never take it off, and this is how I act about this one. I'm gonna film the unboxing after I'm filming this video, so I am gonna take it off for the first time just to put it back to the box and to show you how scratched it got from wearing it for one week. Please let me know down below at the comments if you would like me to make an update video on the bracelet in like, I don't know, a year or half of a year. Let me know your ideas so I could show you how scratched it got from wearing it 24 seven. Yes. So guys, that was actually all for today and yay, congratulations to me for my first Cartier review here on my channel. By the way, I am buying lots of like luxury high-end pieces of items of products but like clothes shoes bags like whatever just high-end stuff because i only buy high-end stuff that's the low in my life i just never like buy anything that less than high-end and i only invest in high-end pieces because i love high fashion so much but i only review a very few of these pieces here on my channel so every review like this just makes me feel so very excited because I just like not doing lots of these reviews. So please let me know if you like that type of reviews of mine and let me know if you'd like to see more and maybe it will give me a motivation to film and to create more reviews of that style. So guys, subscribe to my channel, give this video a huge thumbs up and I'll see you all in my next videos. I love you all. So XO, Valentine.